Hey everyone, this is Bradley from My Memories, and today I'm going to show you how to order individual pages in My Memories Suite. This can be useful if you want to put pages into like a three ring binder or if you want to put them on a poster. Uh, there's all sorts of possibilities. The process is pretty similar to ordering a photo book, so if you watched my photo book tutorial from a few weeks ago, this is going to feel pretty familiar. So the first thing you want to do is, of course, create your album within My Memories Suite. So I'm just going to use this album that I've made before. Then what you want to do is go to the Share tab on the right side of the screen and click the Pages button. If the Pages icon is not lit up, then click the icon anyway, and it will tell you how to resize your album. Anyway, you can see here that the icon is lit up, so let's just go ahead and click it. So first, I want to show you one of the main differences between ordering pages and ordering a photo book. What you want to do is click on this blue Adjust button. In this screen, you can choose which pages you want to include in your order. One feature that's unique to ordering individual pages is that you can increase or decrease the amount of copies of a page that you want. So for example, if you wanted to order a lot of copies of the front page, just increase the number a bit, and then once you're ready, click OK. You can click this button to preview your album, which is always a good idea. You can see here at the bottom that I have all these copies of the front page since that's what I chose earlier. Once everything looks good, go ahead and click the OK button. You can change the save location if you want. The default location is the desktop, and I'm fine with that, so I'm just going to click the Upload button. This next part might take some time, so I'll just skip ahead to when it's finished. Eventually your browser will open up with this window. Once it's done loading, click this blue Continue button. Here you'll be given a preview of all the pages that you chose to order. Scroll to the bottom and then once everything looks good, read the information and click this checkbox, and then click the blue Continue button. This next step is pretty simple. We need to choose the paper stock, cover, and cover finish. There's only one option for each, so go ahead and choose all those. Next, click the orange Add to Cart button. At this point, you can return to the software and place another order if you want to save on postage. But if you're ready to order now, click the orange Checkout button. At this point, you'll be asked to log into your My Memories account. So I'll just do that real quick. If you've previously ordered from us, you can just use your address again by clicking it. Otherwise, click this bubble that says, I want to use a new address and fill out your information. But I'm just going to use the existing address. Same sort of thing here. You can use your existing address or you can type in a new one. Once you're done, click the blue continue button. For a delivery method, there's only one option. So just click continue. Next, you can choose if you want to pay with a credit or debit card or with PayPal. I'm going to do the credit card. Scroll down to the bottom of this page, fill in your payment information, and then click the blue Confirm Order button. And that should be just about it. Thank you for watching, and look forward to more tutorials in the future.